Hey guys, it's Jonah here once again. We're back with another homebrew review. And we're also sampling Mr. Whitby Homebrew's beer, or in this case, cider, because he did send me a few. And this one's a hop cider, um, and it was done <laughs> it was done back in May. Um, we're now in December, so I think I left this one a bit too long, brother, but we'll see how well we get. Um, hop ciders, as we all know, um, Oh, lovely hip. Yeah, hop ciders, as we all know, um, go a little bit with age. Mm, definitely getting the cider. Hops, not sure about. Quite a good carbonation. Mr. Whitby Homebrew is doing, oh, quite a very good carbonation. He does some very, very nice stuff. Oh, Got to be careful here, guys. Because it's homebrew, I don't want to lose any as such wow look at that carbonation man and this has been in the fridge for a while never mind my second tasting will be how should we say be like um a vice cider you know like miami vice look at that lovely color tiny bit hazy might be because it's been chilling out can you see me through there? No, it has got a little bit of a haze on it. Maybe due to the uh, the very good carbonation we're getting. I mean, look at that head, that's at least two fingers. Um, and it's got ice in, and it's been in the fridge. So imagine if I didn't put this in the fridge, what it would be like. Never mind, that's good. Because it means I get a nice aroma now. I can definitely can smell the apples but is there any other fruit there not really I have to say I am getting something though it's like it's a little bit like a kind of vanilla -y kind of mm, vanilla -y aroma but nothing that would suggest this is some heavy American hop so I'm not actually sure uh, what you used in here, brother. Um, but either I've left it a bit too long or it's not coming through. Anyway, cheers. Whitby Homebrew, cheers, my man. Let's see what we get. Ooh. That's a lovely, a lovely cream soda up front, followed by the tartness of the apples. We're getting a little bit of little bit of hot profile in the background, but it's not a very heavily bittered. So I'm not sure what hops you use in here. Maybe it was a lager hop. Nice back sweetening as well. Still a little bit sweet. But yeah, I'm getting a kind of vanilla-y taste and not very bitter, which is interesting because I can't name the hop, brother. I really can't. Does it say how strong this bad boy is? Doesn't say. It just says hop cider. That's all it says. Whitby, you've done me. You've confused me on this. But very nice. It's a cream soda cider. That's what I'll call this one, brother. Um, if you can, if you see this, if you can name the hops down below, that would be really cool. Because, um, <coughs> not even on the belch can I detect anything. There's definitely something in there. Tiny bit of bitterness, very, very difficult to name. This side is lovely. Um, maybe a tiny bit too sweet on the back sweetening, for me anyway, because you know me, I like my kind of dry ciders. 
Um, carbonated, obviously you like carbonated, I don't. That doesn't matter. I'm having real trouble with this one. <laughs> you've stumped me. Whitby Homebrew, you've done, done me, man. You've done me. Um, but a lovely drink, nonetheless. Guys, um, there'll be some more cider, I'm sure, to come soon. But not for a while. Um, take care, and we'll see you real soon. Uncle Jonah's channel. Please subscribe if you haven't already to listen to more beer reviews, more inane stuff, and a lot of homebrewing. Cheers, guys.